So I'm going to answer that in two parts. So um, for the early selection stages, so that's the online assessment and for the video interview, um, the most common uh, reason for failure, I would say, is a lack of practice. There are lots of online assessments, practice online assessments that people can undertake. And there's also lots of practice people can do in terms of doing a video style interview. I would strongly recommend all prospective grads take the time to practice doing each of those things. Particularly video interviews, they can be a bit daunting sometimes. You can sometimes have a bit of a counter and a countdown. If you haven't practiced, it's really easy to get thrown off your game um, and to not be able to answer the question in time. The second part to my answer is, for grads that are successful in getting through to a discovery center with us. The most common failure point at a discovery center is not engaging with your colleagues, particularly during that uh, group activity that we do. So we want to see in that group activity how you work with others. Um, if you are uh, silent, basically the whole time, for whatever that reason might be, it's really hard for us to assess how you're gonna work effectively with other people. So even if you're a bit more introverted like like me, um, think about how you can still contribute to that conversation and interact with others, sometimes inviting other people who are a bit quieter in. Um, all of those things are great and we wanna see how you can work effectively with other people.